In this quick video, I'll show you how to make your Instagram feed full width on your Squarespace website. So let's get started. Let's um, click over to a different page here. And let's say we want to add our Instagram feed as part of our footer so it appears on every page. So let me add a blank section to the footer here. There we go, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make this the same color as the footer so it blends together. And I'll also make the height really narrow and we can um, get rid of this text block in a second, but first let's add our Instagram block. Here we go, I've already got it set up here. So for my design, I'm gonna do 10 per row. There we go. And that looks good. Apply, let's get rid of that text block, save, save. All right, so my Instagram block looks pretty sad there. I could add some um, extra um, padding here at the top either by using a spacer block or let's roll over and edit footer again. So you could add a spacer block here at the top or you could adjust the section height and content alignment. So however you would like to do that. So I've just done it with a uh, spacer block. So now I'll give you the code to paste below. This is from an old section ID, but essentially we're telling the content in this section to not have any padding and to be max width 100%. So what I'll do is I wanna find out my new section ID and I'm using this fantastic Google Chrome um, extension by Heather Tovey that's called Find Squarespace IDs and I'll put a link to that uh, below. You can also find great things like this on my resources page at christyprice.com slash resources. All kinds of great um, useful tips like that. So all you have to do is click the section ID that your Instagram feed is in here. So that copies it paste it into your custom CSS. You can see it's spread it out. It looks a little wonky right now. All I'll need to do is refresh my page and we'll see that code applied correctly. There you go. And if you wanted to adjust the spacing here of the post, you would do that in the Instagram block itself. So let's roll over and edit the Instagram block and go to design. And right now we have padding around the images, but we could reduce that or increase it. We could even take it to zero if we wanted. So that's it, a simple fix to make your Instagram feed full width on your Squarespace 7.1 site. Thanks for watching.